How is everybody today? This is your old buddy Thomas back with Osborne Farms. And it's nothing new today. Cutting down some more trees for the goats. Uh, I've not been up here in about two weeks. Uh, I, I had COVID, me and Melissa did, my fiance. And if you know me and Melissa, uh, we've been over it for a couple of days now, but uh, I just thought I'd come this morning and cut some trees down for the goats. Oh, uh, you know, we've t we talked about the silvo pasture and, and all of that in a previous video, but I uh, just wanted to show them to you. There's old Ruby. If uh, anybody watching this has any tips on how to get her to be more friendly to us, to the people let me know because when i first got her she was you know she loved me but now she's kind of standoffish and i know that um uh, livestock dogs are like that but i want to be able to catch her if i have to take her to the vet or something to that nature you know but uh there's another look and i'll turn it around and i'll get you a better look at it. I love how she stands guard with them. And she stays right with them. She's never very far away from them. In the last video, this doe here had a hurt leg or a, a raw spot on her leg, I guess you could tell. But it's healed up great and I, I didn't even do nothing to it. I mean, she wasn't cut or anything. It was just a spot missing hair and all of her hairs grow back. So she's doing good. been an update old ruby let me catch her and she come to me i had to get down close to the ground i think she is a little intimidated you can see old ruby he's a big polar bear you big polar bear she's a good girl i wanted to get a hold of her so i could check her collar make sure it's not too tight she is growing that's still i can still get four fingers under there Make sure I can't, she's eating. Make sure she's got a good body condition. Make sure she's not got no cuts or anything like that. She's dirty, but she's doing good. 